The Talai family is lucky to have escaped injury when a giant gum crashed onto their home. Tree doctors are urging other property owners to check large trees in their yard before the summer storm season. In the early hours of Friday morning, an almighty crash bounced the Brown family out of bed. We just heard a, the craziest noise and we thought, but literally the house was going to fall over. A 30 metre gum had fallen on top of their Talai home. Took out the chimney and uh, gutters and things like that and it was probably two metres from a kid's bedroom so I was pretty lucky it was that side of the house. Repairs are estimated in the tens of thousands. Fortunately their insurance covers it but Joe admits he waited too long to take action. Well, I've been talking about getting rid of that tree for years because lots of friends have told me that they call them widow makers for a reason so I've seen it wobbling around in the wind towards the house. Arborist Michael Spence says healthy trees don't just fall over. So this is one of the telltale signs um, that something might be wrong with your tree. Michael says you need to look for changes in trees like fungus, dead limbs and cavities, all of which can weaken it ahead of storms. The water will loosen the roots, the wind will move it around. With this tree down and no longer a danger, Joe is making plans to rid his property of another giant gum before storm season hits. Yeah, I could quite easily take out the whole house, I think, so I'd definitely advise on getting them cut down. Petrina Zaffer, 9 Gold Coast News. Good advice. OK.